We have a health alert tonight. A new advisory from the U.S. Surgeon General states that loneliness or isolation could be as deadly as smoking 15 cigarettes a day. Raquel Martin spoke to the nation's top doctor who's declaring the issue of loneliness a health epidemic. We've got to take this seriously. U.S. Surgeon General Vivek Murthy is declaring loneliness among Americans a public health crisis. People are suffering out there. According to a new health advisory published Tuesday, roughly half of U.S. adults report experiencing loneliness or isolation. He warns, left unattended, the issue has deadly consequences. Their risk of heart disease goes up, their risk of dementia and stroke goes up, uh, their risk of premature death goes up to a level comparable uh, to that of smoking daily. The problem also has financial consequences. According to the report, isolation among older adults costs taxpayers billions more in Medicare each year and leads to $154 billion of lost productivity each year for U.S. businesses. This is an area where we can take action. Dr. Morthy is encouraging Americans, religious groups, and community organizations to reach out. To see how they are, to ask them how they're feeling. There's just no replacing that. Dr. Mitch Pristine with the American Psychological Association says the report also highlights the need to stay offline. Especially for young people, the more time they're spending on social media, the more they're losing out on some of the social experiences they would otherwise have. So we have kids more lonely, experiencing more social anxiety. Right now, Democrats and Republicans are pushing legislation to try and dial back social media use, especially among kids. In Washington, Raquel Martin.